Coach 1, secure. Coach 2, secure. Coach 3, secure. Coach 4, secure. Now the presidential, uh, um, not, not secure, not secure. Oh, Mr. Railgate, sir! Bah, you can just call me Eli, what do you Mr. want? Mr. Eli Railgate, sir, we've discovered a defect on your private car. Really? How severe is it? Well, the front coupler knuckle is rusted through and completely weakened. Alright, what does that mean for me? Well, because it's compromised, it could decouple during a move, or any number of other things that I can't currently think of because it is that bad. Uh, sir, as the president, I don't advise riding in a 100-year-old broken rail car. What do you mean? Broken, broken rail car, broken rail car, really? Yes. This thing is historic. It was yes, on the I first know. train to ever cross the Echo Stars so Valley. Know. The ENGF Railroad has made it clear that we are Nowhere. dedicated to preserving the history of the Echo Stars I, Wilderness, I, 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 particularly I the Rolling Stones. I know, I know about all this, sir. If you're really this dedicated, you could give us a couple hours to fix it. Hours? A couple yes. of hours? This yes. is my inaugural train. I'm becoming the literal president of the company. I'm not going to delay the I train know. by a couple of hours. Uh, fine. Whatever you say, sir. Should I give the preceding order? Yes, please. For the last 127 years, we, the Echo Spire and Grand Falls Railroad, have been moving cargo and passengers throughout the most remote canyon in the entire kingdom. Commissioned by the King's Royal Guard, we forged through the wilderness to create a rail line linking the port city of Grand Falls to the growing metropolis of Dreamcliff. We were far ahead of our time, as the only other railroad to have traversed this route, Goldex Holdings, didn't do so until 95 years later. We intend to carry on this rich history of this rail line for generations to come, and today I am stepping down from my position as CEO and handing this railroad over to my successor. Everyone, please welcome former engineer Eli Railgates. Thank you, everyone. It's it's really an honor to be here. I'm I'm the youngest president the railroad has ever had, and I never thought I'd actually see this day. Now. Some of you may have misconceptions about me. You may think that since I'm only 19, I don't care about our railroad's history. But I can assure you that is not true. As we speak, we are traveling behind a DF-class steam locomotive on authentic ENGF railroad cars. And even my presidential car, like, that was on the first train to ever cross the Echo Spires wilderness. So, I, I do care, and as president, I promise to expand our steam program and to save the GP class diesels and scratch build a replica of our first passenger depot at Slide Rock. Because I do care about our history. We're heading off the Dream Cliff Plateau and beginning our descent to the beautiful Echo Spires Valley. So, uh, if you want, you can go over to the lounge car for a nice panoramic views, or you can uh, head to our dining car where you can taste our signature meals. So, thank you again, everyone. So, Mr. Real Gate, it is nice to meet you, young Popune, CEO of Goldex Holdings. Kill more, no handshake for me. Look, kid, 
I get that you're a little bit obsessed with history. I get you. But what I'm saying, you can't spend infinite gold pieces from preservation. I mean, just look at my company. We crank out billions of gold pieces a year because we're willing to put the past behind us. See how we're riding over a bickery old wooden trestle? Look over there. This gold axis big concrete arch bridge. The pinnacle of modern engineering. And look at the train rolling across it. It's a funeral train, isn't it? You're taking all of those RS classes, all of them, every one of them. You're taking them to Dreamcliff, and what are you gonna do with them? You're gonna torch them, and you're gonna sell the ring for gold, aren't you, Paul? Exactly. The RS classes are broken down, so we're gonna use them for money. So you're learning things about business. So the RS classes were your first locomotives. When you built your line back in 142AT, they were your first locomotives. So what? So they're historically significant. Well, look at how much better off our company is. We built an entire empire of rail lines across the kingdom. All you guys have is one dinky little connection. And that's a route that we also serve. We built through all the same terrain you did. We just did it better. Our tracks parallel each other through dream close to Castlebrook. Then you go around Mount Westridge while we go have a 20 mile tunnel through its cave systems. Forget it. You'll never drive us out of business, pun it. Yeah, yeah. Calm down, kid. You still have a large advantage over the trucks. Look about monarch trucking. The king's literal royal company. The roadway between Jim Crift and Grand Falls is terrible. You guys are still far better than them. Whatever. Where are you going? I'm... I'm going to the dining car to get refreshments. Thank goodness for the privacy of my private car. I can't stand that guy. Oh no, oh no, no 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 no, no 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 What was that? I have no idea! Someone, someone stop the train! Stop the train! Your private car! It's the couple that was running the train! I think he went to the dining car for refreshments. Ugh, I told him it had a faulty coupler! The car was about to run away to happen. We've gotta sell it out somehow! We just routed into a derail sliding. That's what we ought to do at Gold X. There's one coming out at the town of East Grade. East Grade, NGF, we copy. This is business train B17. We're being rammed by runaway coach. We need you to route it onto the nearest derail siding. Are there any passengers on board? No. No, derail it. Copy that. What's going on? Why have I been routed into the siding? You, you know what it means I'm gonna... Uh-oh. Where am I? What's going on? Why am I upside down? Am I? Am I dead? You could have been comrade if your car uh, wasn't caught uh, in who, the soft who branches of this Who are you? Are you some kind of like sequoia. spirit that's supposed to lead me to the afterlife? Again, you're not dead. Now take my hand, or you might be, when this coach inevitably drops to the forest floor. Why would I need your your hand? Ugh. Is it some kind of like weird artifact that For needs to like? For the last time, you're not dead. Well then. Who are you? I'm Morgan Evergreen, track worker for the ENGF Railroad. And you, sir, are my new CEO. So let's get you out of here before the car falls. Before the, the car falls? We can't just sacrifice the car. It's historic. It's ancient. It's... Yeah. Yeah, we can sacrifice it. OMG! You did it, Morgan! You saved the president! Are you as smart as everyone says you are? Talk later. We gotta hop into the speeder and get our comrade to safety. The town of East Grade is just a few miles down. So, uh, who are you guys? 
I'm Sophie Victor, and this is the Triple Threat, fastest repair crew in the West. You like that? Obviously. You owe us your life now, so... We're actually just truck crew 423 for the EGNF. We happen to know you were stuck down here. Shut your big mouth, Bill. We're the fastiest, mostest, awesomest, and mostest stylish, not to mention mostest, bestest, professionaliest track crew in the West. Uh, is, is she even, like, qualified for this job? I don't even know, comrade. Why are you calling me comrade? Because out here on the open rails, out on the high iron, we are all brothers and sisters. We love unconditionally. You wouldn't understand being from the big city and all. I mean, I wouldn't understand. I'm a former engineer, you know. Sure, but have you driven a spike, cleaned a firebox, hung from a tether while replacing the piers of a trestle, fixed the turbochargers on a GC class? <sighs> Judging by your silence, I guess not. But I'm the I'm the president. I'm the president of ENGF. Ah, uh, you'll understand soon enough, comrade. Group one, two, three. Do you copy? Don't call us that. We're the triple threat. Look, I don't care what you call yourself, but hear me out. You've got to get off the track. Why is that so? There's a runaway train coming your way. Yeah, the private car? It crashed. We saved the president. No, not the private car. I meant another runaway train. A Gordex freight that lost control that we ran it onto our engine uh, track. Dang, how close is it?